the 2022 season, 2023 season, can't be coming soon enough for Ohio State. Mainly because they only have one QB. One QB in the recruiting class. Air Nolan. He's not the answer. Recruiting, they have two five stars. Okay. Ten four stars. Eight three stars. And one two star. The real problem with Ohio State, it is Ryan Day. It only comes down to Ryan fucking Day. He's the issue. Okay, he's bad. He's one in four all time against the team up north. You can't have that and still be one of the better teams in college football. You just can't. This team right here, they cannot compete with the big dogs upstairs in the Big Ten if they continue to play the same way they've been playing for the last three seasons. 11 wins. And then you get to the team up north game, to the game, and you lose. You drop eggs like nobody's business. That is the problem. It is Ryan Day's fault. I want Ryan Day fired. He is the problem. Bill O'Brien, he won't fix the damn situation with anything. If anything, get Ryan Day out as soon as possible. Because these these recruits, you know, J, uh, Julian Sayan, Caleb Downs, Will Howard, Quidshawn Junkins, uh, Will Kamarick, Seth McLaughlin out of Alabama, got two guys from Alabama, Aaron Noland, they won't be seeing playing time. And for all the people saying that only black QBs are good at Ohio State, you need to get this. You need to stop with that, okay? White QBs can be good too. I know we've been saying give them time and all this, you know, nonsense, but in all actuality... They can be good. There are white QBs in college football that are always good. Okay, sure, black QBs have been, you know, the talk of the town in Ohio State because they've been only been good. But you're just not giving white QBs a chance. The bottom line is Ryan Day needs to get the hell out if they want to beat the team up north. All these recruits that I just named off, five, two five stars, ten four stars, eight three stars, and one two star. Those guys won't be seeing the field if Ryan Day, you know, stays at Ohio State as the damn head coach. So it is time to fire him as soon as possible.